Have you been looking for a desktop replacement notebook that can do everything from video editing to gaming? Well, on this episode of Gadget, we've got Gateway's P7801U. We'd like to thank our production sponsors, the California Province of the Society of Jesus, the Advanced Network Computing Laboratory, and Gateway. Hello, and welcome back to Gadget at the Techstop.net. It's a place where it's always time to get your geek on. I'm your host, Father Robert Ballaser of the Society of Jesus. I'm a member of the California province of the Jesuits. We are the largest religious order in the Catholic Church. And we're here again in the Center for Apostolic Technology in Honolulu, Hawaii, on the campus of the University of Hawaii. Now, a while back, you saw our CES coverage. We went over to Las Vegas, actually to Henderson, our, our little home slash studio there, just above Las Vegas, where we uh, started to assemble all of the coverage, all of the video, all the raw footage that we would need to give you your uber geek goodness from the largest consumer electronics show in the world. We needed something that could not just download our videos quickly, not just give us enough workspace to really do our editing properly, but also have the performance so that we could get the rendering done before the conference was actually over. Now, we didn't even have desktops in Henderson that really would be able to do that, so we called our friends over at Gateway and asked them if maybe they might be able to supply us with a computer or two. Well, they were nice enough to send us this. The 7801 UFX is one of Gateway's top-of-the-line desktop replacement gaming-capable P-series notebooks. Like its predecessors, it's designed to give the user a powerful and portable desktop-class gaming machine. It weighs 8.39 pounds and, and is 1.3 inches high, 15.65 inches wide, and 11.65 inches deep. It's covered in a glossy graphite-colored shell with rust accents around the keyboard and sides of the unit. A 17-inch widescreen WXGA LCD dominates the face of the 7801U. With a native resolution of 1920 by 1200 and an ultra-bright coating to enhance color and contrast, this display is gorgeous. I didn't see any brightness blooms or color blotching and the contrast was uniform across the screen. The LCD is backed up by NVIDIA's GeForce 9800M GTS with 1 gigabyte of discrete GDDR3 memory. The bezel is topped off by a 1.3 megapixel camera for video and stills. Ports abound on the 7801U. There is a Kensington lock port on the rear left of the 7801U to secure your notebook in high-risk areas. The left side also sports two stacked USB 2.0 ports, the heatsink vent, and an 8X DVD-RW. The back of the 7801U houses the power plug, the modem port, and a sizable battery hump. The right side of the notebook holds the VGA port, HDMI 1.3 output, eSATA connector, gigabit ethernet, a third USB port, firewire connector, audio jacks, and the 5-in-1 memory card reader. The front of the 7801 has a hardware switch for the wireless networking as well as a release button for the lid. Like the other notebooks in the P-Series line, the 7801 has two bays for 2.5-inch SATA 2 hard drives. Gateway includes a single 320 gigabyte 7200 RPM SATA drive, but they also give you the caddy for adding a second internal drive. You can use this second drive to simply add storage to your system, or, if you desire truly insane transfer rates, you can run the 7801U in RAID 0, striping the drives and boosting transfer rates by up to 70%. For those who want even more storage, for example if you plan on using the 7801U for video editing, the eSATA connector gives you the option of having a super high-speed link to massive amounts of external storage. Built on Intel's power-efficient Centrino 2 technology and powered by a 2.26 GHz Intel P8400 Core 2 Duo CPU sitting on a 1066 MHz bus, the P7801U is loaded with two sticks of 2 GB DDR3 1066 memory for a total of 4 GB to run Vista 64-bit Home Premium. Networking the P7801U is easy, thanks to the integrated Gigabit Ethernet and Intel Wi-Fi Link 5100-802.11a, B, G, and Draft and Wireless card. The keyboard in the 7801 is a full-size unit with separate numeric keypad. Gateway seems to have improved the keyboard on this latest generation of P-Series. The keys are responsive and evenly spaced. The keyboard is topped off by a row of illuminated function buttons that can launch the media center, control multimedia functions, and adjust volume. Gateway also includes stereo speakers just below the screen that are quite powerful for their size. 
When we ran the 7801U in balance mode while simulating typical web surfing, video watching, and light editing, the battery lasted almost three hours. We were able to get almost four hours by turning off the wireless, dropping screen brightness, and limiting the CPU to 50% of maximum. Even when I switched the notebook into performance mode with Wi-Fi enabled, the screen at full brightness while pegging the CPU with video rendering, we were able to eke out one and a half hours of continuous work time. That's quite impressive considering the amount of computing horsepower that comes with the 7801U. I don't know exactly what gateway has changed, but it's obvious that they've tweaked a few things between the 7801U and the 7811FX because this model spanks the 7811 in all battery metrics. A note about sound, Gateway received a few complaints about the noise level of the 7811FX, so they retooled for the 7801U, and their work is definitely noticeable. When I had the laptop set for power saving mode, I didn't hear any fan noise. In balanced or performance mode, the fan was audible, but not annoyingly so. In benchmarks, the 7801U topped even the Gateway 7811 for pure performance. In PC Mark Vantage, we were able to hit 4618 versus the typical 4261 of the 7811. In 3D Mark, we topped out at 4267. For some real world testing, we threw Bioshock, Crisis, and Pure 2 at the 7801U. In all cases, we cranked up the eye candy, and the frame rates were still fantastic. The Gateway P7801U FX comes with a one year warranty and is available now for about $1,200 at your local Best Buy or from Newegg. The best compliment I can give this is that this was CES for us. We were able to take every piece of footage, every photo, every video, every interview that we did at CES went through this computer. And we were able to use this screen, this keyboard, this mouse, this processor, and the dual bay of hard drives to, to get everything out on time. I mean, it, it really showed us that you can get a competent traveling machine that can do high performance, high definition video editing. And that's just phenomenal. Now, that's not to say that there are no negatives with the 7801U. The first thing has to be styling, styling in the P-Series in general. Now, I, I know that in the past, I, I've just shown how much I, I like the styling. I mean, I really do it. it. It is designed quite well. But even me, a guy who likes blinky and shiny, is getting a little tired of the glossy look. I mean, it's nice. It, it is really nice. Don't, don't get me wrong. But it stops being nice when it attracts fingerprints from air. I mean, what, what good is it to have a notebook if it's going to look like, a, well, a, an inkblot, a Rorschach test, or, or a smudge? Can I lay down a challenge here to Gateway and say, please, be the, the manufacturer that, that starts the trend back to sort of a matte finish? I, I don't care if it's matte plastic or if it's brushed aluminum. I don't care if it even adds a little bit to the price tag. I think it would be worth it to have a, 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 a competent notebook, something like this. This performance in a case that doesn't have to be cleaned every 30 seconds. The second problem is not so easy to fix, and that is the whole idea of pricing and model placement. Now, you may know that Gateway switched away from their direct sales model a, a while back. Now they sell directly through retailers like uh, Best Buy or Newegg. And, and that has worked out for them quite well because it allows each business, each retail location to choose the models that will, will best attract their customers. And as a result, you as a customer wins. However, it does get a little bit confusing, especially when, you know, when this, epi when this episode goes up, it's probably going to be difficult to find the 7801U. Uh, I'm betting you could probably still find it on uh, Newegg, but we've been getting comments from our previous users that it's hard to find the, the P-series that I reviewed. And as, as a result, they have to kind of look for just the specs of that particular P-series. Now, th this, again, is nice because it gives us a lot of choice, but... I wish Gateway could work out something with their marketing department. And again, I'm not a marketing person, and, and they do have smart marketing people at Gateway. But get something that would give us a bit more conformity across the line so we know who is offering what and how this model of P-Series compares to this model of P-Series. That's, that's just a thought, Gateway. You know, see if you can follow through on that. However, even with all of that, I have to say I really, really like the P-Series notebooks. I mean, this thing did perform admirably. It has all the ports that we want, including FireWire, which is always something that we're missing. I think the only port that I'm looking for probably would be a, a, a DVI connector instead of the standard VGA connector. I, I think that is more in line with what this is designed to be, and that is something that replaces your desktop. Now, if you are looking for a machine that is portable and can still handle your video editing needs, or if you want something that you can bring to a LAN party and just whip out your latest copy of crisis or play a session of world of warcraft or if you want something that is equally comfortable being on your desk doing a spreadsheet might i suggest you take a look at the p7801u 
Now this is available now, as we mentioned, from Newegg for about $1,200, which is fantastic because that's about the same price as a 7811, and this outperforms it in every way. Now if you want to find out more about the P-Series of notebooks, please go to Gateway's website at www.gateway.com. If you want to find out more about our take on this notebook, go to our website at www.thetechstop.net. While you're there, go ahead and click on the Gadget tab, and you'll be able to find all of our episodes in high resolution. If you want to send us an email message, and please keep those messages coming, you can reach us at gadget at thetechstop.net. Well, I've been your host, Father Robert Ballasare. This has been the Center for Apostolic Technology. And remember, there's no Uber Geek without you. <laughs>